Ooh, well, <clears throat> is this working? Can you all hear me? Give me a yes in the chat if anyone's in the chat. I'm gonna keep track of the chat on my phone because I don't have another screen. How's it going, everyone? It's been it's been a while. Uh, a lot has happened. A lot has changed. Uh, wait, I think I need to. Yeah. All right, great. Uh, so yeah, how's it, everyone? It's been a while. Uh, it's been a hectic couple of weeks, couple of months, actually. Oh, God. Hey, Jabby, what's up? Uh, it's been like four months since the last upload. I am very sorry for that. Uh, a lot of stuff has happened, actually. Um, I'm going to wait a little bit until more people get here. So we can discuss some stuff that's been going on. Uh, but the most important thing is that I'm I'm good. I'm fine. Everything is good. Don't worry. There's nothing. Nothing horrible has happened. Um, everything just comes down to time. To be honest. <laughs> now that I have a little bit of time on my hand, I can I can do this. Just for a while. Ah, oh, thank you, Javi. Yeah, it's been it's been good. I've been hearing about you on uh, Twitter, actually, too. That's mostly where I'm active right now, because um, it's kind of like, oh, oh no, oh no, wait, 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 no, really, come on, it's the first one. Ah, uh, give me one second. I need to ch grab this. Promoting a little bit more. Uh, very good. Uh, well, that, that's uh, that's a terrible way to start. <laughs> I'll say that much. I added some modifications, like having the shields. I have the spin dash, just to make the game a little bit more fun. Because it is Sonic One, you know. It's lovable, but it's kind of hard to love it. Damn it! Shouldn't have done that. There we go. Ah, uh, thank you. Yeah, that's basically been what I've been doing, my focus in the last couple of months. Trying to prove my art, trying to prove everything. Um, the, oh, oh no, okay, get it! Oh, wow, okay, I'm terrible. <laughs> it has been a while, and I'm still bad. I know, right? I'm just bad. <laughs> shouldn't even be playing anymore. I'm done a marathon of like Sonic 1, 2, and 3 in like oof, close to like 5 years. Like in a round. What's up, Tom? All good, all good. The return. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, I, I was gonna discuss some stuff. Hey, Night Sevis. It's great. I'm looking at the chat. I'm just eating bumpers like a dumbass. Yeah, it's good. It's good. I love. Uh, I wanted to stream for a while now, but I didn't know when to return. Just, uh, time has been, time has been a big issue lately. I feel like I'm James Roll or something. Here it is. Can I, can I attack it or? Okay, no, they fixed that. Yeah. Um, other than doing art, I'm also been going back to college. Uh, COVID is finally taking a step down, slowly, so I actually have to go to college, it's not virtual classes anymore. That's gonna be, that's been taking a, a chunk of my time as well. Oh man. Don't get hit in the first boss, again. Find the dog and concentrate, here it is. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> but, um, I've been dealing with a lot of, um, college and a lot of uh, commissions and a lot of uh, 
Hey, it's Sonic Beyond. What's up? I was commenting everyone where I've been this last couple of months, why I haven't been uploading. If anyone's still here. Um, college, work, uh, animation channel that I'm, I'm returning to slowly. Um, and that kind of left the channel a little behind. Like, I, I've been planning, I, I have a couple of videos on the works. Then my hard drive kind of failed and I lost a bunch of that, which that kind of killed any motivation. <laughs> and then seeing how well the commissions were doing so good, so I I decided to focus on that mostly. Uh, commissions actually been my... Uh, well, to start off, like... At the middle of last year, I began taking commissions from everyone on Twitter. Uh, it's been a blast. I love uh, drawing for everyone. Some designs were great. Some designs were eh, okay, but <laughs> I'm not here to, do uh, to judge. Um, that's been going great. Then, luckily, last year, I got in contact with my good friend, uh, Volcomia, um, uh, Sonic Central. We struck up a, a partnership now, and I'm his official thumbnail artist guy now for uh, for his main channel. Uh, that kind of like made me realize that hey, look at that! Um, at the time, I was working a hotel job, which was okay, but really mentally taxing, and again, also a night shift, which I just I just lost my chance again in the Emerald. Wow. It was also a night shift, so that kind of like, ugh, I don't know, I worked a night shift for a long time, but now it's like, oh, I don't know, man, I don't know if I have that that in me anymore, especially for hotel, because I don't care about hotel. I have 10 years of uh, hotel work experience, but it's not what I want, <laughs> that's the thing. And then this chance came along, where I can just draw for people, and actually getting paid for it. Um, luckily, and well, unfortunately, I'm trying to make a good situation, a bad situation good, because my country is not in the best place economically. And that means, that translates to the dollar being really big. <laughs> like, astronomical. It's terrible. But at the same time, that's mean, that means that $60, it's a good chunk of money here. Um... And with my commissions, I actually managed to leave the job. Damn, I, I'm terrible. <laughs> I'm terrible at this. Um, I left my job, yeah. I quit, quit the hotel. And now I am a full-time freelance illustrator. Drawing for people, taking commissions, drawing for uh, Lee and his channel. It's been... A dream that I've been having for a long time and the fact that now it's real it's like whoa that's I remember seeing a lot of people like hey I managed to get this I managed to do that and I'm like wow I'm kind of like a downer when it comes to that uh, I'm always feel like oh shit well I'll never be able to get that I never be able to do this and it's you know it's that defeatist mentality um, the you kind of grip get into it's kind of hard to get away from um, luckily, I just kept going because that's literally all I'm I'm good for. I thought I was good for making videos, but eh, well, that that's yet to be seen. <laughs> um, I'm definitely not good for talking. That, that's a given. But uh, no, yeah, now I quit it. I quit the hotel, and now I'm working from home, with my own time, my own schedule, and luckily making good good money so I can eventually move out with my girlfriend to. Uh, uh, Canada. So that's been happening. Taking commissions weekly, though, has made me not being able to work on videos that much. I am, however, with this, I want to announce that I'm actually restarting again the channel. I've been writing some uh, some scripts, working with some people, so um, I can't promise. A lot of uh, consistency with my schedule, how it's going. Especially because uh, I still have a ye Okay, I thought that was over. I still have a year left of college to worry about. 
uh, a year and a half, two years actually, mostly. I'm in my fourth year and I'm closing to my last year. This year is supposed to be easy, but I don't know. A lot of my classes are kind of like, eh, I don't know. I, I'm more focused on teaching and that's not what I'm, that's not what I want. I don't want to be a teacher. And uh, that's making it kind of hard to uh, focus on college, but I need to finish this last year and then next year is going to be really, uh, really chill when it comes to college because I only have like three courses and that's it. And then I'm going to be over and I'm going to be done with it. And then, I don't know, hopefully, hopefully if I manage to, uh, if I manage to expand more with my channel and the commissions and I don't know, maybe <clears throat> getting another monthly work as a, a thumbnail artist or whatever artist. Luckily, that would be enough for me and my girlfriend to move out. It's gonna take a lot of money and a lot of uh, effort. A lot of uh, sleepless nights. But uh, I'm confident. I'm confident that maybe in a couple of years I can, I can grow exponentially. I'm trying to be transparent right now as well. I like my country and it's where I come from and everything, but it's not good right now. It's not in a good place to to develop. Uh, my girlfriend, she's not from my country actually. Um, she's from Italy and she moved here with her family like a long time ago. And she always also felt kind of like an outsider here. So we both have the mentality to, okay, let's um, leave this behind and look for greener pastures. Hopefully my country will get better at some point in the future, but right now, I don't know. Hopefully, hopefully eventually changes. I'm checking the chat real quick. <coughs> hey, Weber the Constant. Constant. Uh, yeah, the export videos. Those were like my big first push to getting back in the community. shouldn't underestimate that because I remember uh, it was 2020 I don't remember I think it was September or something I just woke up and said you know what I want to make a video because I've been watching these Iceberg videos and I I don't think there's any Sonic one uh, well not even the Iceberg one that's one was the second video I just woke up and said you know what I want to make a video about Sonic what can I talk about okay I remember being a kid and seeing all those places where you can go with Knuckles but you cannot go with Sonic what happened if you go with Sonic or oh, those places where you can go with Sonic but not Snuggles. Okay, what happens when you go with Snuggles? That, that was like my little k stupid kid curiosity back then. I wanted that. Hey, Arizella, yeah, boy. What's up? Welcome to the stream. Just chilling a little bit for a couple of hours. I'm trying to shred through the games. And I didn't know, but uh, uploading that actually opened the gates. And now I know a lot of people. Uh, I got um, a lot of people in the community that been friends with now and it's yeah it's insane because if i hadn't woken up and say you know what i want to make a video uh i wouldn't have been able to leave my job and start working as a freelance artist uh right now it's gonna be without if i added sonic city it's gonna be way too long of a stream and i we need to beat this up until um, it's right now uh 2 30 in the afternoon in the afternoon, I need to beat this all up until 6.30, which is when we got the uh, Sonic Central stream. We're going to be discussing the Sonic movie. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Um, and I'm not over. I feel like... Uh, right now, it's going to be the classics. Just one, two, and three. <laughs> right now, I feel like I abandoned that. And I want to make videos again, but okay, I, I don't want, I have to expect, I gotta, the thing is that when the Icer video hit and it started getting traction, I, I was kind of like, oh shit, this is my big break, I gotta do something. And I didn't. And it's really hard to recapture that chance because I don't know, next video, it's not gonna get as many, um, as many views and, and get as many people as I'd like. That kind of demotivated me a bit because I was expecting like, okay, I... People are mentioning me, okay, I should do something, but I, at the end I didn't, I couldn't because of work and a lot of stuff, and now that's over, so now I can just focus on this. 
Bar uh, partly, because I also have college and I had a lot of stuff to worry about. But I do want to work. I want to do uh, this. I want to help channels. I want to build my own. I would love to build that community, even though I'm I'm really not the most interesting guy. <laughs> um, so I don't know. I'm gonna, I want to I wanna stay here, but I need to put on the effort. Even more effort than I need, because I'm, I need to push everything to 100. With commissions, with YouTube, with everything. So, uh, I'm writing a video right now. It's going to be a long one. It's going to be uh, a Sonic Friends tier list. Which is going to be kind of an excuse of a tier list, because I'm actually just going to be analyzing the friends. To which friends work better or not. Since the whole stupid debate about Sonic Friends coming back after the Sonic movie 2. Stupid IGN and their stupid ass reporting. Oh man, IGN just doesn't know when to quit. They just don't. They I don't know, man. My friend Muda actually made a video about um, IGN being completely incompetent yesterday. In fact, it was like a late upload, and I couldn't agree more. You don't want to work at IGN, dude. All those freelance writers, you could make more money being a freelance writer and just posting on your own stuff than just being hired by IGN, which I think they give you like $20 or something. I don't know. I'm not too sure. Something like that, if I remember uh, this video. Let me get that. Let me get that. <laughs> Some special things. Oh, uh, my audio? The microphone audio or the, the game audio needs to be higher? I can go a little bit with both, actually. Uh, game louder, I'm louder. Uh, let me know if that's better. It's been a while since I've streamed. <laughs> yeah, I remember being stuck in that part, like, oh. <laughs> Uh, wait. If I just get closer. Is this better? Oh no, oh no. Just let me get it. Perfect, alright, good. Uh, so yeah, think of this, this, uh, think of this as a restart. I hope I can, uh, I gotta make it. I gotta keep pushing this. I see people that I just keep making videos and I'm like, man, why, why am I doing this? Why am I, why am I not doing that? It's what I want, why am I not doing it? I think it all comes down to motivation. Now I have motivation to uh, draw a lot more because it's literally, literally my job. I've been doing a lot of commissions. Um, also, if you want to support me in any way, don't, don't just, don't, don't just, don't donate to YouTube right now because uh, seeing how my country is still fucked up with the uh, dollar and everything, <laughs> it'll be better to just donate straight to my coffee if you feel like supporting. Com completely no strings attached, of course. This special stage is terrible. Oh my god. Uh, I hate the stage. I hate it. I hate Sonic One special stages. Come on, stay there, stay there, stay there. Oh no, come on, get in there. Ah, shoot. Come on. Oh, oh no, oh. Stop, 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 stop. Okay, okay, slowly. I hate this stage. I just want the emerald. Give it to me. Oh no, oh no, it's going faster now. Stop. <laughs> if you've seen my video about the special stages, this is basically what I think of it. Sonic 1 sucks. No, no. Just get there. There it is. No! I swear to God, you better just get there. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No! Stop! 
If I lose this emerald, I'm gonna fucking scream, I swear to god. Oh my god. Just get it, come on. No. No! Oh my god, this is terrible. This is terrible. This is grab it! Yes! Oh boy. Oh boy. The music, really? I don't know. I tried, about, I tried with the special stages, but. Uh, it's not for me, I guess. Yeah, that's basically... <laughs> oh, Anthony Sullivan, I, I, I bought a Vaporizer from you and it didn't work, what the hell? Uh, yeah, I hate the special stages in the first game, and I'm not gonna hide it anymore. <laughs> I want to make this a full supersonic run, but I don't know if I can make it, because one is such a... They're, they're terrible. Relatively easy, yeah, if the camera and the physics work with you. Which, uh, again, I guess it's the point of the special stages. I love the music in this game, in this uh, zone, actually. I remember when I was a kid, I was just 18, just turned 18, and for the night, me and my friends went to the casino in town. And as soon as I got into the casino, the first thing that pops into my mind, seeing the rug and everything, and the people, the machines and everything, this song, this song just pops into my head. I'm just walking like fucking Mr. McMahon with the <laughs> the Springyard Zone music. It's great. I love it. And that was when I left the Sonic community. I guess I never really left Sonic. <laughs> and now Sonic is literally paying my bills. Let's go. One of these days, I actually would love to do... Uh, an advanced Sonic Advance uh, stream. That would be great. I love Sonic Advance. I love Rush. Maybe a Rush one. I'm. Uh, I'm not too big on Rush Adventure, to be honest. Now that I fully played it, what the hell happened there? I'm not too big on Rush Adventure. It's a, it's a good game, but I don't know. It's. Oh my god, I'm sorry, that, that was me because I talk about fucking <laughs> Rush Adventure not being great. Let's get to Sonic 3. Alright, sure, no problem, Javi. We'll be here. Also, don't forget to go to uh, Sonic Central channel so you can catch the uh, Sonic Movie 2 discussion. Of course, if you've seen the movie, it's gonna be a spoilers um, review of it. It's gonna be, we're gonna have a. Uh, uh, Dempsey, we're gonna get Chow Mix, we're gonna get a lot of people. There's why the fuck I'm not hitting that. I'm getting here. This boss is too pity to me, I love it. Coming to the origins comes out because of the compilation after this is before coming. Oh, that's that sucks. I don't remember how I did it, but um, it works well in this, both games. Advanced games are based, especially 3. I don't know why you guys notice like there's this slow hatred towards Sonic Advance 3. I don't know about you, but I love Sonic Advance 3. That was like my favorite advanced games. Back in the day when I only had my computer, I could only play the advanced games and the classics because I could just emulate them. Advanced 1... I remember being a kid and seeing the report of wow. Sonic Adventure 2 Battle and Advance releasing. That blew my mind. I was like, there's no way a Sonic Advance looked like that. I spent so many nights, so many days, so many bathroom visits just looking at the pictures of Sonic Advance 1 on, my, on that uh, Nintendo Power magazine. It was great. <laughs> I loved it. Can I do the skip in here? I forgot what I have to do. Okay, that's one. That's 
do. Oh shit, okay, never mind. There's no skip. The other two are too difficult. Uh, two? There was something with two that I agree. Oh yeah, the special stages of two. Advanced two has the worst special stages on the trilogies. They look great. They are fun. They feel like Mario Kart. But the way to get to them is so asininely difficult. The game is all about speed. You need to go fast all the time. There's no time to stop. So why in the hell would you make it that to get to the special stages, you need to explore the area and find seven rings? That's just stupid to me. What? How do you get to the special stages in this game? You just collect 50 rings and get to the end. I feel like that would have been the better course uh, to take for Advanced 2. That's why I never, ever completed uh, Advanced 2 special stages. I remember downloading a save file that I beat in it so I could just see the ending with Super Summer, which is sadly like the most epic one. Just saving Cream's mom, going to the planet, having that little cutscene of you just falling back to Earth. That shit was epic. And I could see it only when I downloaded a, a save file that I had completed. It was terrible. Something on widescreen. What is it? It's a mobile. It, it's the, the compilation of the mobile ports. You can Google it. Um, it's really easy to set up. You're gonna need to have the uh, the phone versions installed somewhere. For what I remember, really, it's been a while. I think they updated it, so you don't really need the games. But I'm not too sure. You can just Google the the compilation. Advance 1 had the, those uh, power units of uh, absolute units of springs that you need to find and just jump on them, which was okay. It was kind of like hard to get a grasp on, on the the distance, but they were still fine. I found them all right. Never mind. I said it sucks in the video, right? Well, things change. Where should I go? This. Thank you, Arrow. Oh no. Just let me go. Oh no. Arrow. Arrow. There it is. Okay, we're good. We should be good here. Stop falling. Damn it. Oh no, no, no. Stop falling. Just get in there. Get in there. There we go, there we go. Ah, damn it, never mind. Go down, slow down. Let me grab you. You're good, you're good, you're good, you're good. Yes. Woo! Yeah, so of course it's my little PC get combo which means it's looking at version. Really? Yeah, three three is good. Maybe playing it again. I played it again like two years ago on my 3DS. I modded my 3DS to have all of the advanced games. Um, and 3, I still like 3. I love the plot. I love the, the... It's just a connection. It's basically a sequel to Sonic Battle. That's something I really miss when they did more stuff with their uh, spin-off games. Back then we have Spinball, we have fighting games, we have racing games, we have whatever game. Now we only have racing and the Olympics. Where is Sonic Battle 2? I'm dying. I, you, I don't know if you've seen. I post a lot of battle style artwork on my Twitter. Where is 2? I miss Sonic Battle. Sonic Battle was great. I miss these giant stories with a bunch of Sonic characters. I miss when they took more risks with uh, spin-offs. I would love to see... Uh, Sonic Battle 2 someplace. I would love someone to make a project Sonic Battle 2 because I would 100% help with the artwork. <laughs> I swear to God. And, well, at least luckily we have the fans picking up the slack. Uh, Sonic Smackdown is amazing. It's great. And before it went to shit, I think Sonic Gather Battle was pretty alright too. Eldrin, what's up? My favorite zone of Sonic 1, actually. I'm not lying. Labyrinth is actually my favorite zone of 1. I don't know. It's something about the music and the style. I, I know a lot of people hate it, but I just... I just can't get enough of it. 
A lot of people say, oh, it's Green Hill or Starlight, which are absolutely valid, but I think Labyrinth, it's green. <laughs> Starlight, yeah, Starlight is still great. Back to speed gameplay, it's great. So I have to take the day off from commissioning to um, work in this. Uh, great, great, great. I had a newfound sense of uh, motivation. So I actually just announced that I'm going to be back and making videos because um, I think I can manage if I just work around with my timetables. I stopped making videos mostly because I have no time. I have to work commission, I have to work college, I have to work several other stuff in the meantime and I legit just didn't have time now that I left my job I quit my job to be a full-time um, freelance artist uh, as you know already <laughs> um, now I'm just feel like I'm more motivation and now with the Sonic movie 2 just what a great film dude I loved every second of it um, I just feel good I feel like I want to try again uh, trying to recapture the thunder I know my latest videos haven't been, um, oh shit, I'm really happy with the editing, uh, I'm kind of sad that they didn't get a lot of uh, attention, but hey, that's part of what, the, the, the trip, right? I just gotta try to capture that, uh, that magic again. Hopefully build a little community or whatever, just to have people, oh, uh, come and check around the streams, come check around videos, that'll be great. Especially with the help of uh, everyone else, like you, Chow Mix, uh, Sonic Central, Matt, everyone. That'll be great. Uh, I remember correctly, there's a switch in here, yeah. Someone told me, I like the game, so it's the Sounds one or one time to the game, so it's all like different. Yeah, it's really just great. No, it's all like two. I would discuss the movie with you guys, but I don't. I don't want to spoil anything to anyone. I don't want to assume anyone has seen the movie, so I will not talk about the movie right now. If you want to talk about the movie with spoilers, uh, head over to Sonic Central in a couple of hours. Also, if you want to know, I actually did the artwork for uh, the thumbnail. <laughs> To be honest, uh, what's inspired me again, it's um, Chomix. Uh, the guy has such good work ethic and he's been like, just like rising, rising above everyone for like the moment I remember seeing his channel with like 2,000 subscribers. Now look at him, the guy's a titan. He's <laughs> a great guy. Also my talks with my friend Murahar as well. Like, do this, you can do this. You don't need to be a giant, you just need to do whatever you like. There's a lot. Of, oh, thank you. Wow, I haven't watched the first movie. This one is the second, it's out. The first movie is all right, it's a uh, perfectly digestible, silly movie. Um, oh, damn it. The second one is like what every Sonic fan wanted. The second one is straight up amazing. I loved every second of it. I was glued to the screen all throughout. Oh, just let me get this to the end. Okay, this is not a good labyrinth stage. I still like Labyrinth. Labyrinth is great. Uh, oh wait, this is uh, Act 3, is it? I completely forgot, actually. <laughs> Let's go. I gotta beat this Egg Boy. Hopefully I don't get completely destroyed because I don't have a... I don't think I have a shield. Here, the shield is shield above, right? Yes. Not the most useless, useful shield for now, but... Ow! 
That was terrible. I think I only managed to destroy Eggman, like hit him eight times once in my life. Doing this climb. Oh, that's it. Okay. There we go. Well, that room. Alright, I don't think I'm gonna make it with all the emeralds, but uh, we'll, we got some. Oh man. Hello, Labyrinth. This music is great. But let's just cut it back because we got the invincibility theme again. I don't need to grab those. Don't fight me. I won't fight you. I uh, I say that Labyrinth is my favorite, but that doesn't mean Labyrinth is the best one. I think this is the best one, <laughs> but my favorite is Labyrinth. That's all I'm saying. You can have something favorite and not necessarily be the best. For example, I my favorite Grand Theft Auto is Vice City, but I'll 100% agree that San Andreas is way better. <laughs> All right. I don't want to go for a second. This, I wonder how many years it passed now. Sometimes you're still gonna forget some easy stuff. And there we go. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can get. I don't even know how many emeralds we have. Three. Might be a little too late to get the emeralds. To the Sonic Best of World. I don't know if best, but I can tell you my favorite. My favorite is without a doubt um, Labyrinth Act 1 and 2, especially on Sonic 3. The uh, music, the storytelling, everything, the plot, the music, everything just blends together so perfectly. I love that. The music, oh man, special. you're gonna see, well, we're gonna play Sonic 3 after, oh no! Damn! Okay, I guess we're not getting the emeralds in this playthrough. <laughs> Labyrinth is fire. No kidding. No, but something, like, there's so many details, small details that I didn't realize until, like, years later. I remember when I discovered that... In Act 2, Labyrinth, you can, well, in Act 1 and 2, you can slowly see the dead egg moving forward. You can clearly see that at the end of Act 2, but in Act 1, you can see it, like, in the distance. Like, wow, I actually never noticed that until, like, years later. I played Sonic 3 since I was 5 years old. I was born in 92, the game released in, uh, 94, was it? Jeez. Actually, that, I can't believe how connected Sonic is to my life because I remember one of the first memories that I have as a kid is my dad getting me ready for kindergarten while I was watching Adventures of Sonic. That little rat's been in my life for almost ever. I can't believe it. I know it's just a character created solely for commercial purpose, but hey, Ken and I connect with people. Launch base. I like launch base. Storytelling wise, is pretty good. I love. I always love seeing the the dead egg just taken off, seeing the giant fire. Like, oh man, that that was so great. And the big arms fight. That was also pretty good. That was the first time that I was kind of like understanding storytelling. Like, okay, this is the same egg, the same dead egg from Sonic 2, and I was trying to take off again. Because one thing you gotta remember about me is that my country didn't have official Sega stuff, so we always have bootlegs. And all of the bootlegs, of course, they didn't come with manuals. So we can only speculate as to what the story was trying to tell us. I didn't know about anything. I, I didn't know about Knuckles, um, people, or the tribe, everything. Everything was transmitted to me through the uh, visuals of the game. I couldn't read out that Knuckles like grapes back then. <laughs> 
stream stories video. What was your favorite story and you wish for the clock? Um huh, I'm trying to remember. There was I think the first one when Sonic tells and Knuckles go to investigate and then you just leave. That was the that was a pretty good one. But then there's some really bad ones like the the one where Sonic just literally just waiting for a date. No, it's uh, Kiara waiting for a, a date, and the whole game will be okay. I'm gonna get the Chaos Emeralds to make you a necklace. That's like stupid, man. Come on, dude. don't do a story like that. I'm playing terrible. That was a great video. I remember working on that. That was a really fun video to make. Making all of the animatics for the uh, games. That was really fun. Uh, maybe I can do it again, but I don't know which, which game. Also, I need to do the my part 2 of Sonic X. Sonic, yeah, the game that's definitely coming out. Sonic Origins is definitely happening. <laughs> Are you gonna throw one in the middle, Chief? Okay, it's ignoring the middle now. He knows. Like strats. This boss is pretty... Pretty bad. I don't like this boss. There's only one bosses are kind of like, eh. Kind of me, to be honest. One thing that I always had to do as a kid is just like align all of these perfectly. There we go. Balance restored. Let's go. Release date? Nope. There's actually they're actually deleting evidence. What I think they're they don't, I don't know what they're doing, but they just don't want to show the game yet. It's gonna be a solid year since Sonic Central presentation. Yeah, service blood best. Alright. Uh, oh shit, I forgot. What was the name of the beta of this stage? <laughs> I forgot. I mentioned it in my Sonic 2 beta video. Also, another thing that I wanted to check with uh, you all. Uh, since now, doing Sonic Art, it's basically what I'm doing for... Uh, to earn my bread. <laughs> uh, I'm probably gonna release a lot more videos of Sonic um, focusing on the art. Maybe tutorials, maybe art streams, I don't know if that's something you guys would be interested in seeing. For everyone who doesn't know, you can all follow, follow me on Twitter. I'm very active on Twitter. Uh, platform, platform. Oh no, oh no! Okay. Uh, it's gonna be a mission impossible to try to get to the end of this stage with all of my uh, rings. I don't think that's gonna be a thing that happens. Damn it! Ugh. Of course I just missed everything. Clock, uh, clock orc. There you go. Clock orc. So <laughs> it's clock orc, but then I, when you hit the stage, it doesn't. The W doesn't show up. It's like literally clock orc. Oh, okay. I thought it was a bottom of the <laughs> So I have to go now, but I wanted to check how you're doing. Is someone else here enjoying the stream? Too? Oh, no problem, Fungi Arts. Thanks for stopping by. That means a lot. That's because I've been really quiet on the channel. It's good to see that some people are still showing up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the lack of content. Ooh. Ah, oh, come on! I want to be fast. This game won't let me be fast. Okay, good news. I'm... Almost positive that we can get the Emerald Team 2. I still remember how to do it. But since I hate the special stages of uh, Sonic 1, I don't think we're gonna end up with all the Emeralds. Hope that all counts for you. <laughs> oh, thank you, RLs. R. R. O. S. Yeah, I'm uh, gonna try to be more active in here. I got my start on, uh, well my start on everything because I decided to make a YouTube video, so I need to be active on this too. Well, that was a bad throw. Ross. Okay, Ross. Okay, 
Alright, let's try again. Not to fall into the fire and blow my ass again. Look at that face in the background. Oh man, this face. This fucking background reminds me of when I did those uh, Sonic animations. Uh, with uh, Sonic Central, we were talking one day. Maybe eventually do a cringe stream. Where we talk about our cringe Sonic past. Like, man, I can talk about my OCs and my story and my animations. The thing is that I actually have animations still saved from like, G 17 years ago. <laughs> oh, dude. Those will, th those will not let me sleep. I don't think I'm gonna show them because it's really too bad. It's it's really bad. Maybe if I... Well, that's on me. If, oh. <laughs> Maybe if I get... Uh, better with YouTube and I get a... I don't know, a mouse or something. Maybe I show something. But if we ever do the stream, at least show the character, which is literally just called Nubicles. I remember telling this to Muda and he would not shut up about it. He would he would not let that go. He would never let that go. And you know why? It's fine. It's part of me growing up. It was cringy, but at least I, I'm actually really impressed with the fact that, oh shit, I managed to actually do 34 animations. 34 episodes, 5 minutes long each of this stupid ass story. Oh. Okay, I got an idea. Uh, jump. Jump. Guys. Ow. Yeah, there's no way you're getting 50 rings at the end of the stage. Uh uh. Where am I? Oh, oh. Not paying attention. There we go. Alright, good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I had the dedication back then. I don't know. If, oh, I don't know if there's any dinosaurs in the chat, but do you remember a site called the um, the Valley of the Chaos Emerald, something like that? Something else. No, no, no. Never mind. Uh, it was called Mystical Forest Zone. It was, it was a, it, I think it was a forum site. I don't remember a lot, really. I barely spoke English back then, so I only published my uh, my uh, my sprites that I edited, and that's it. Mystical Forest Zone. That was it. That was the name. Exactly. I had dedication. Like back then. Then you see today is like, oh man, I cannot complete a comic. But they just look at you. What you look at what you did like. 12 years ago, you had dedication, so you need to get that again. You need to tap into that. Okay, uh, let's get to take the shortcut. Ow. Ass. Person. Man, sometimes I wonder what happened to some of the people from those sites. I barely spoke with everyone because I, I couldn't speak English back then. <laughs> what am I saying? I can barely speak now. Oh! Ooh! Wow, what a save. Oh, man. Come on. Oh man, oh shit. I can't say anything, I just remember something. <sighs> okay, let's just finish this one. Well, I could have avoided all that by just going a little bit farther. I forgot. Oh, that's true. That's true, Chandru. <laughs> Let's go! Okay. Let's finish this. Oh, who is that I see in the chat? No! Uh, oh, that didn't hit? Come on. I'm 
remember being a kid and reaching this and being like, oh, there's no way this is the end. Back when I couldn't even beat Mario fucking <laughs> Gabor. Come on. Many more. One more should do it. The worst thing about my animations is that I actually included shit like Chris Thorndike and the robots from the Sonic X. Oh, it's terrible. Oh, there you go, that's Sonic 1. I love Sonic 1 still. Look at those beta flowers though, purple. Yeah, I know, Sonic. I'm sorry. I didn't get the emeralds. Ah, uh, beautiful. Snow brings a lot of joy. You want started at all, huh? Robotnik is dead, yes. We killed Robotnik. <laughs> No emeralds? No, I guess not. The one is pretty bad when it comes to getting them. I'm not a fan. Not a fan still. Alright, who is... Just the gun and just... <laughs> if anything. Sounds like a creepypasta. Man, the time of the creepypasta is what a wonderful time. You guys want me to go through this or you want me to just switch to the next game already? It's like the Archie comic when a robotic just dies and just replace him with a robotic him. I would, but uh, we have uh, like just enough time to complete all three games. Yeah, I don't know. The first games, uh, special stages, I just cannot deal with them. With two, I can. Like, 90% get him, or like 80% get him all in the first um, zone. But with Sonic 3, I can 100% get him. Sonic 3 is literally the, my favorite game of all time, so I can, I can still walk through that. Like, it's no business. Yay, <laughs> shut up, Eggman. Okay. That's the first one. Let's just very quickly open up the second one. Let me switch it real quick. Okay, there we go. Uh, game options, what do we have? Air speed cap, no. Tails flight, yes. Super tails, yes. I said one, spikes, disabled. Items time two and three. It works for me. Play before and after the sequel. I should. Uh, one of these days I'm going to do a uh, Sonic mod streams. A Sonic uh, fan game stream. So you can play. Um, I'm going to play that one. I can play anything really. Okay. Uh, this playthrough is going to be a bit of um oh wait the, the low AI why is it too low oh I can set cat to is that good or is it too low oh I have the uh, this might be tedious because um, I want to get all of the emeralds on the first zone. 
so it might be a tad boring, but as soon as I'm done with this, we can just relax and go through the game as Super Sonic and just say, <laughs> screw you to anything. Excuse me, I want to get to the, my special stage. Ah, oh, yeah, the skellies. Look how beautiful this looks, man. I can never go back to playing the Sega Genesis version. <laughs> Genesis version is still a classic, though. I remember for a lot of time I had Sonic 2, then for some reason or another I would lose it. Yeah, that's what I, I was check actually. I forgot if I had removed Tails or not. <laughs> uh, cartridge swapping was big back then, so I don't know. I think sometimes I would just lose the game because some guy would be a dick and never get it back to me. I remember a dude... Uh, I think I gave him two games. I think it was Double Dragon and Sonic 2. He gave me something shit, like, I don't know, maybe... I don't remember what it was. I think it was like Doom Trooper or something, shit like that. Three days pass and I wanted to get my games back, and then I get news that the guy moved to another fucking town. I was so pissed. This was like back in 2002 or 3, I don't remember. So mad. Oh, I was looking at the chat. I didn't grab the last one. Small Sonic, bro. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I hate it. Thanks, Speedy Sonic. You are Sonic, it seems. Bye, Sonic. Alright, let's try to get everything back here. <laughs> Oh man, my cartridges. I just remember how much I hated that guy because of my cartridges. No, don't get hit by the fucking monkey. Ah, come on. That's another shitty thing. You need to get all of your rings back as soon as you finish the special stage. <laughs> It's okay, I'll do it again, it's no problem. Uh, I could do it quick. Look, I have 20 rings already. And now I have the shields. Pretty good. You guys have any funny Sonic stories? Like, losing all your cartridges? Uh, I don't remember if there was another one before here. I got more than enough rings to another emerald. To another emerald, so... Oh, never mind. Yeah, that's the one. Trying to get all in order. There we go. Man, another thing that... Uh, ripped out the bottom of the side show. How? Why? Why would you do that? I remember... I don't know if you guys... Remember MSN groups? First of all, you all remember MSN <laughs> Messenger? That was like the biggest shit back in the day. That was like before MySpace, man. Like, holy crap. That was old. MSN groups were also these like little communities. Like, oh shit, I was not looking. Little communities like, um,. Facebook, so, sort of like that. That's the best description I can give him. Uh, but focusing on random stuff. For example, I was I was part of a lot of uh, groups that were focused on Sonic. I spoke to a lot of members of the community back then, like 2007 or something. Man, that was so cringe as well. People would write interviews with the Sonic characters. Like it was all just fanfic writing. I don't know, interview with Sonic and just do stuff like that. Oh no, oh no. What am I doing? Six rings. Oh, shit, perfect. I 
here's an interview with Sonic, here's an interview with Knuckles, or something like that, and it's, it was fun, but man, looking back at it, it's like, eh, you know what, I'm good. <laughs> Luckily, MSN Groups is long gone, so I don't know if any of those uh, interviews survived. And I may or not have written a few. I'm gonna leave that hanging there. Okay, I think I can get one more in this, in this uh Newgrounds shit. I remember seeing an animation of Newgrounds like years back. Fuck! Of um, Sonic and Shadow fighting. I remember that animation being incredibly epic. You know how every Sonic animation is. You have to have Dragon Ball Z shit all over. Um, but I remember it being great. No! Oh, okay. I forgot where I was gonna drop. Okay, can I get back up there? I don't know. Fuck you, monkey. Those monkeys are terrible. I hate them. Okay, I gotta get back there somehow. And not get hit by the monkey. Man, what am I doing? I don't know how to play Sonic 2. Ugh. Okay, very important. Not get hit by the monkey. Not hit. Okay, I almost fell. Let's try this again. I feel like such a dumbass right now. <laughs> I feel like these should be easy. No! I got hit by the fucking monkey! Oh. Damn it! <laughs> Shit! Alright, let's see if I can get 50 more. Is there any way for me to get 50? Man, what a slap. Oh, God. No more monkeys, please. I, I'm so done with the monkeys. Okay, good. Uh, that's an extra hit. I'm good with that. Alright, I should be able to get all of it. Yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, let's do it. I hate the monkeys, dude. The monkeys are like the rotating guns. In Sonic 3 and, and Sonic 3D Blast. I hate rotating guns in games. That should be a, a, a community joke. I just hate rotating guns in games. Because they're just, aimle just aimlessly just shooting, but they always hit you. I hate it. Okay, there we go. Let's, let's try to save this one. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna stop looking at the chat while I do the special figures because I need full focus on this crap. Go wild, but behave, come on. Oh, this one is easy. I remember. Alright, good. Okay, good. So far, so bueno. I don't remember a lot of it. Well, no, actually, I kind of remember this one. It's not too hard. Sonic 2 special stages, I remember a lot. Not as much as Sonic 3, though. Oh, what a. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, good. Oh, shit, I thought I fucked up. No, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Oh, boy. I feel like I'm losing my sense into these games. That was pure reflection. I had no idea that was coming. Reflex, not reflection. What are you talking about? Trying to speak when I'm trying to focus. Is that it? <sighs> yeah. Woo. We got three boys. We could get 
<laughs> the last four, the next stage. We're good. Alright, let's actually beat this game stage. Go! Fuck yourself, monkey. Yeah, nothing like completing Emerald Hill Act 1 in 5 minutes. <laughs> Time we gonna have to only time we have to do this. After that we just won't alone with Sonic. Super Sonic. Uh, yeah, this game is just making fun of me now. Oh come on! I hate the monkeys! Come here. Damn it! Freaking monkey. The uh, special stage is down. It's in the next loop. It's right there. 50 again because of the damn monkeys. Can I even get 40 now? 50! Oh, fuck. I almost fell! Oh, damn! Stop it. It should not be this stressful. He's trying to get 50 rings. Damn it. I cannot. Alright, 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 alright. How do I do this? Damn it. Okay, I'm gonna jump on this. And avoid it! That almost hit me. Okay, I got 50. Come on, come on. Let's go. Alright, you're good. You're good. You gotta jump there. Okay, good, good. Let's do it. Oh, boy. There's no reason for this to be this dreadful. Oh, I remember this one. It's a tad annoying. Not too bad, though. Oh, oh man, I almost screwed that up. All right, come on. One ten. Okay. Oh, I think I remember. No, what am I doing? It's not like the other ones. Oh, okay, I did it. Oh boy, this is stressful now. <laughs> Maybe that's why I don't complete this a lot. Throw me a curveball some at some point. I'm sure of it. Oh! Wait, that's it? Oh, good. Boy, why am I being so surprised? I feel like. Oh, damn! Wait, I think my controller died. Man, he died at the best time possible. Also. See again. Uh, okay, this works. One second. Yeah, controller decided to die. It's fine. It's connected now. Uh, all right, gotta go back. Get 50 more. I got that damn for them or finally. 
It was a damn four hammer. Oh, ho, ho. I forgot the monkey was there. I could live in a world without monkeys. Okay, this is pretty spooky. Oh, okay. And there's one right here. All right, good. Ah, this is the green one. I think I have to go in circles in this one, from what I remember. I'm not too sure now anymore. Okay. Oh no, I just gotta... Yeah, I gotta go in circles. I hope monkeys can go fuck themselves in this game. <laughs> okay, yeah, this is the also your own circles. Oh man, I think I screwed up. Okay, simple. I feel like these were way harder when I was a kid, but they're still pretty hard. Kidding, this shit is terrible. Okay, it's giving me a few range to grab everything, and then it's just gonna throw red bombs at me. I'm sure. Okay, I'm good. Is that it? Yeah, simple one. <laughs> Okay, two more. Uh, I know exactly where they are also. Let's just grab those 50 again, avoid monkeys, and then get them. Yeah, I still got it. I still got it with Sonic 2. I thought I was like a little bit um, rusty when it comes to it, but no. 2 is just a CC. What am I doing? That was on me. That was completely on me. It's not just monkeys that can hit me, it's also my stupid ass just making mistakes like that. <laughs> How many more of those uh, shields? Sonic Ring Sound Effects. My dream tonight! <laughs> yeah, no kidding! Uh, I think I gotta go... Stop. Yeah, I remember now. I messed up. Go back. Oh, no problem, no problem. As soon as I'm out with the special stages, I can go back to paying attention to the chat more. <laughs> Damn it. Wait, there's... I don't need to do that. Ah, what am I... Oh, okay. I'm good. I don't need to do that. I can just do this, right? Oh, yeah. Perfect. Okay. And... Yeah, monkeys. One up. Thank God for that one. <laughs> that shield. Okay, here we go. Six more boys. Get hype. Get hype. I don't remember what to do here. It's gonna be a disaster, isn't it? What have I done? Oh, damn it. <clears throat> okay. Okay, I cannot mess up now. I need to grab all of them. I did it. Oh. Oh, man, the boss repeater. I did it. Oh, man. Come on. Okay. Two, where are the rings? Here. Here. Oh, what a... Oh, damn. I messed up. I don't know if I can do it now. Oh, 
man. What am I doing? I'm so... Oh, okay. Oh, man. I am so stressed out. <laughs> These things are not messing around. What do I do here? Oh, damn it. are putting me on the edge now <laughs> we did it luckily I remember the last one pretty well so it should be easy I conquered the monkey that was horrifying yeah actually that was I oh, man I felt like I was just driving a truck blind Alright, let's get those 50 again, and... The last one should be pretty okay, because I remember doing the last one a bunch of times as a kid. Let's get there, come on. Last one should be okay. I'm not saying that to you, I'm just saying that to me because I need to reaffirm the fact that I might be able to quit. Ugh, monkeys. Okay, now I'll just rush this zone. Get to the last one. It's literally the last one right before the boss. There you go. Go, easy, easy does it. Okay, good. Let's go, boys. Let's finish this up. Uh, I think this is like this, the fifth one, where you need to just like jump around. Yeah, jump around, jump around. Damn it. Stop switching your shit. There we go, there we go. Okay, good. They like playing games, dude. They just switch it up like so many times. That pattern was annoying. It's like one, two, one, two, one, one, two, two. This one was. Uh, oh. Okay. I think they changed with this one. Let me just keep staying like that. Okay. Oh, never mind. They do. They do. Okay, good. Not as hard as I thought. Okay, the, the last one is pretty dumb. I need to dodge a barrage of bombs. But then just grab these loose rings all around. I think we're good, though. I think I need, like, 190 and I have 200. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> we're good. We're good. We're good. I can, I can afford to get hit, like, twice. Yeah. I think we're good, though. Yeah, look at that sky. We did it. Look at that. We did it. Now we gotta got. I gotta fight Eggman. Hell yeah, I can change the supersonic. Just to uh, not get here. We're not gonna do super right now. All right. Again, five minutes on uh, Act Two of Emerald Hill. Only in Novica. 
Well, I, I would like to be a little bit more of a scenario, so I'm just gonna hit one. He's gonna throw the shit. There we go. I like this to be a little bit more cinematic. Supersonic, baby! Didn't think I could do it on the first one again. It's been a long time since I did all the special stations too. They're they're pretty they're pretty stressful, dude. I do too, dude. I was like on the edge like all the time. They are great stages. I I don't I don't dislike the half bite, but um, they were not forgiven. I was really stressed all throughout. This is like the third time in a row that I actually been streaming Sonic 3. <laughs> I'm gonna be streaming Sonic 3 after I'm done with this. Man, the second stage you see more in Sonic, more in Sonic games. I'm actually kind of tired of seeing Chemical Plant in a new Sonic games. Like, okay, just let it go. We see. we see it in Forces, we see it in uh, Generations, we see it in Mania. Legit, <laughs> say 3 is great. Power for me, oh dude, that would be a good challenge. Just stream SA3 every single day for a whole year. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe next year. <laughs> Let's go, let's go. I could never do it though. <laughs> I don't think I can stream the same game every single day for a year. That's a tall order. Now we're waltzing to the now. Because I just took five minutes off of each of the first acts in the first song to get a piece. No problem, your boy. Thanks a lot for uh, coming. Checking how many people were still joining the stream on a dead channel. <laughs> it's good to see some uh, people still hanging. Motivating. Man, I still remember the first time I um, I discovered Super Sonic. It was actually in Sonic 3. <laughs> and I told my friend. Uh, remember, we didn't know, we didn't have any uh, manuals back then. All we have were all bootleg cartridges, and that's it. And I was like, "Man, you unlock Golden Sonic." We called it Golden Sonic. We didn't call it Super Sonic. It was Golden Sonic. <laughs> it was like a like a, I don't know, limited edition Sonic. Go, you got the Golden Sonic. You can go to the Sega factory now. We're going a little too wild, Sonic. Oh. Sonic 3 R. Oh, we're gonna do we're gonna do Sonic 3 R. Don't worry. Uh, one thing I wish they would have added is just have Sonic do like a victory pose here. I, don't, I hate that he just looks bored after saving the money, the the monkeys, the saving the people, the animals. I like this area. I like the color palette in this area. Aquatic rooms get don't don't get a lot of respect lately actually. Yeah, it has great music too. Funny 2 overall has legendary soundtrack and I, I I just repeating what everyone's been saying. Like everyone knows this game is goaded. Back up there. There it is. Thank you. I remember having an achievement. I think it was the the mobile version having an achievement um, that if you don't touch water in this section, you get an achievement. <laughs> that was it. You can completely avoid the water in this stage. I want to see if I can do it. I think I avoided the first one. I'm gonna see in Act Two. Super Sonic is busted, dude. In the classic games. Okay, I just 
want to get? Oh, man. I just want to get 50 rings so I can just go wild and avoid everything. Get out of here. I cannot stress the amount of times I play Son of Three, by the way. <laughs> Avoid the water. No! Okay, okay, I'm good, I'm good. Let, get out of here, flies. Damn it. Okay, okay, alright, one second. There we go. Alright, alright, there we go. Alright, now we're good, now we're good. Yeah, boy to the water, boy. Through your water. Aquatic ruins my eye. It's just ruins. Easy boss. Oh boy. I'm gonna need to take something to eat real quick. But now, now, oh, let's keep going. Casino night. I love how when I talk about how I felt when I walked in a casino for the first time, it was not hearing this song. It was actually hearing Spring Yard and not, you know, Casino Night on a casino. <laughs> it's fine, Anthony. We'll be here for a little bit more. Sonic 2, Sonic 3 takes uh, a bit longer to complete, so you, you're good. I'm gonna make it. Thanks a lot for stopping by. I love your products, even though I have to return that one. Man, I still remember when I told you when I told you all about um, my dad waking me up and seeing Adventures of Sonic as a kid. That was still a time where uh, the dubs, for some reason, may tell a girl. I don't know. I don't know what the deal with that was. Why is still a girl? It was called. It was not called Miles. It was called BB. Why? I don't know. I would actually love to find a reason for that. I'm gonna have to, I have to delve, delve a little bit into that. Once until Sonic X, and that went all for Sonic. It, that went on with um, Adventures of Sonic and San AM. and I don't know why. It wasn't until Sonic X when uh, Tails was for as a man. As a boy. What? Maybe I'll try to contact the voice actors. The dubbers. I'm gonna get a straight answer as to why. It'll be an interesting video. Officially halfway there. I don't know how long I've been streaming for, but I think it's almost two hours already. Man, and Sonic 3 takes almost two hours to finish. I think I'm gonna finish as soon as the uh, stream starts. The Volcomia stream, the um, Sonic Central one. Let's see if I can speedrun this in a little bit. Ah, good. I've been playing these games for a long time, but I don't feel like the advanced games are getting that much love. I would really like them to do Sega to do something like Castlevania did. Like, literally, something Konami did, which is saying a lot lately, but uh, they actually released the advanced games in a compilation not too long ago. Games that I never thought I would see re release again. I would absolutely love to see a Sonic Advance collection. So I got Dance 1, 2, 3, and Battle. And why not? Spinball Party. Just throw it there. Throw, throw it in the mix. Why not? 
you can imagine Advance 1, 2, and 3 again for the first time since the official release. They've never been released anywhere else. I think Advance 2 was released um, in the virtual console. So that's it. Alright, let's do this. Sorry, Eggman, I'm super. seen the when Sonic 2 was in development they wanted to bring some of that past and future stuff into the game just like um, Sonic CD did but the thing is that I think they they just left that idea outside just for Sonic CD early on but they still managed to do some assets like I remember seeing that Hilltop you see how the tiles are literally the exact same ones from uh uh, Green Hill. Hilltop was supposed to be a past version of Green Hill. Oh, no, Green Hill, Emerald Hill. That's why they use a lot of the same assets. I'm okay with that. It's too broken, though. Start at two. Uh, I'll be right back. Okay, give me a little bit. I'll be right back.
Let's kick it back a little bit. Phone because I'm poor and I don't have another screen. Okay, maybe that jump. Oh, hey, I didn't, I didn't even notice. Let's go. Sorry, stage. Come for me to therapy. Sad. I <laughs> just can destroy the stage like that. Super Sonic is really busted. Better nerf. <clears throat> what else do I have? Mr. K right after Mr. K we just go over. This was my favorite stage as a kid. The rapid music, everything. The fucking color palette, the design. Spooky and great. I mean, it was not all Sonic 3, but still, it was pretty good. with this stage, well, the only issue with having the Super Sonic is I remember you can self-lock the game. <laughs> okay. I think if you de-transform as soon as you hit the goal post, and you jump again to transform at the right time, you can actually just stay on the, on the air, suspended, walking in the air, and the game will self-lock and you'll be fucked. <laughs> Not much of a sub log, it's just like a weird glitch that just keeps you there until the time runs out. That diabolical trap of Dr. Eggman. Uh, Casino Night, no, it was uh, Carnival Night Zone. So you walk into one of the areas right after Knuckles turns off the lights. <coughs> walk right into one of those uh, slopes that go upward. Oh man. Where I was playing. I 
okay, this game release, this version release to this stage, there's no way for you to play the game normally now. You have to do Hidden Palace. I just wish it would have kept the music. I know about, I know Proto, uh, Palace and everything, but I wish they could have just kept the original something. But hey, we got a whole new last stage. Yeah, I did, don't worry. We're all here. I don't know how to activate debug mode in here to go to Proto Palace though. Because I know there's Proto Palace where you can just go there and use the uh, the code to uh, get the actual stage that we saw on too with the music and everything, but I don't I don't know how to use debug mode in here. As long as pretty nostalgic though. I love how the, they went all out in the music this game. Not only in the main stages, but also for the uh, special stage, the, the versus battle, the two players mode. They had no reason to go all out in the soundtrack like they did, but they did, and it's great. So I hate this boss. I hate the new boss that they introduced here. I just wanna beat him real quick. to be that easy. <clears throat> no, it will be terrible if as soon as you beat this, it just takes you back to the start of Mr. K. That will be bad, right? Stop, I just remember this stage with being angry because I remember one time I got up to this stage and then I think the game glitched or something happened, the console turned off and I have to do all over again. That's what I always that's what I will always remember about this stage. That happened when I was a kid too. I was at a friend's house and damn, after a long time of playing everything, the game just fucking dies. Such a kick in the balls. Palace is a requirement now. You cannot play this game without going to get a palace. Mystic Sona 2 would never see its boss again. <laughs> CJ, what's up? Halfway through the screen now. Let's see if I can beat this game before dying. Because I'm actually pretty hungry right now. Got all the emeralds in this one. We didn't get the emeralds from the first one because screw those special stages. And three is gonna be a breeze. Central stream later. We're gonna discuss the movie with spoilers. Do -do -do -do. 
Ugh. It's also announcing that I'm gonna be making some videos uh, again. Hopefully, um, in a couple of weeks, I'm gonna have something to upload. In the meantime, we're gonna always the screen. I always found a real pressure in there. Oil pal, oh, oil ocean, oil pals. That's a new stage, oil pals. I don't want to get hit, I just want to go super and screw the stage. Oh, don't hit me. Oh man, am I going to have super for this fight? Eh, it's not too hard, I'm good. One, two, okay, I'm at two. Wow, wow, I am messing up so much. Come on. cycle because it's just <laughs> one die. And uh, everyone's favorite stage now. stage. I don't think anyone is. Where are those Metropolis defenders? I want to see them. I want them in my office right now. Let me go super and I'll be out of here. Okay. There we go. Okay, let's just run. I'm gonna make this stage feel like it's friggin' Starlight Zone. <laughs> I'm just running through these fucking balls and knots, I hate it. So slow, I remember being a kid and just trying to run them with tails. It would be, go fast, but Jesus Christ. They're cute, they're a nice addition, and it fits the stage, but goddamn, I just can't with those things. Where do I even... Oh, here. Okay. No, no, don't fall. Ah. Can I just keep going through here, or is it going to repeat all over? Oh, never mind, I go. Okay. I'm not a big fan of this. It makes you wonder, how could this game turn out if they actually added the stages that they had to cut? What if we had Dust Hill? What if we had Genocide City? We have Woodson. Woodson was like actually real. Are those assets actually in the game or in the beta? I should cover more betas. I love covering betas. Imagine if they find the Poker Game Show now. First first beta of Sonic One Show. That, that's a relic good. I really hope someday we can actually find one. 
Yeah, I'm a triple is just really a pain in the ass, I gotta be honest with you. I don't see anyone ever defending Metropolis. Let's get it, yeah, Tommy. According to, um, I think it was Naka himself, I think he said that they just lost it. And it's just forever gone. But man, what if? What if we actually have in their balls, like, just somewhere. Someone found the, the Nintendo uh, PlayStation. Why can they not find the Sonic Beta? The, the Sonic DJS one. Damn it. I, I just get goosebumps just imagining how the community would explode. That would be incredible. Super Saiyan Sonic, yes. One more. I never understood the hitbox of those things. Thank god that you can actually have the insta shield in this game. But to be honest, it's just more of an offensive tool than defensive. The only thing shield about that thing is that the invincibility frames. They're really finicky. They last like literally a second. Come on. When will you think that 2000 Sonic nostalgia is gonna hit? Because whenever I see the movie or anything, it's always 16-bit Sonic with the old songs and everything. When are we gonna get some representation nostalgia when it comes to the 2000s? We're, oh man, weird thing to ask, it's something I've been noticing, because everything we, every time we talk about something Sonic, classic, it's always the 16-bit uh, one. But the thing is that, am I going to die here? Wait a second, how the fuck do I even get there? How, how, what did I do there? Also, was that the first time I died? Honestly, can't remember. I get the classic Sonic, it's literally just a 16-bit, but now we're getting another additional classic. Adventure 2 was literally 21 years ago. At Sonic Adventure 2 can go drink. We should do something more when it comes to the, those classic, because those are the games that the new generation played with. We got our fix of classic Sonic stuff. Wow, I cannot believe I hit that. It's this thing again! Give me a ring at least. How do I get there? Okay, God. Oh, fuck off, Slicer. Doesn't feel like we're gonna be getting any Super Sonic in this stage. Mm -hmm. Fine, I can achieve every battle. Ah, uh, ah, uh, stop. Did I just kill the star? All right, they had that unused uh, animal friend that you have to rescue. Yeah, look at that. Can I see it? I want to see it again if I get a chance. Never mind. I did not hit. <clears throat> I think those went kind of unused because you can't kill them, but you can see them through the walls. Oh man, the slicer. I have some arms. Okay, we're good. <laughs> uh, second. Well, 
it's dead. Never mind. Ah, if I were Sonic, I would just get all of them in one sweep. What was the funny part about this boss? You can just get all of them. Wow, this boss is actually giving me trouble. I cannot hit the... Can I get the timing right? There we go, okay. It's, just, it's dead now. Let's go. Done with this shit. <clears throat> Let's go, Sky... What is that? Sky Chase. This feels like the, the turning point, like, okay, we're nearing the end now. We got this special ass stage now, Sonic and you know, Sonic and Delphi can be flying. Up to the fortress. Ow, damn it. All of the little turtle boots. Getting a little bit nostalgic about um, my old videos when I did with Moto. My, well, his videos. We're talking about possibly making some uh, gameplay. The other night we actually were net playing Mario Party 7. <laughs> that was stupid. I, that was really fun, really. That got me thinking, man, it's been a while since we did anything for uh, Moto's video, when his channel. He doesn't mind, he literally told us that his, cha his channel is a shit post, so... <laughs> Maybe hopefully we're gonna see something. Last thing I did for Muda was a uh, stream, I think. We streamed... Either GTA 5 or Monster Hunter, I don't remember. It has been a while. We can't really stream GTA with Muda because he gets fucking sniped. Stream sniped. I still talk with the guys every single night. Um, we would have a call from Elixir. Whenever, whenever we can get a chance to get on a call again. I'm gonna just play shit and just remember old stuff. Oh man, I'm getting a little bit nostalgic about um, how we used to do the Mind Mortal readings. Man, the Mind Mortal readings were like seven years ago already. Jesus Christ. I remember I went to Vegas uh, to visit the guys in the last part of the series. That was... Yeah, that was 2016, I think. Yeah, 2016. I went to see them on the, the 22nd. I will never forget that trip. Vegas trip was my first time in the US. Hopefully not the last one. I really fucked up right there. <laughs> Well, now we're doing that again. In the end, I didn't never, I never found out if my model was actually a troll. I'm pretty sure it was a little troll story. But man, I, I remember reading that back then and being like, my god, this, there's no way this is real. I, what the hell? I wanted to go get the shield. Let's just get knocked down again. Okay, now we gotta chill because I know you're super, but. 
be a little bit fucking slower. There we go, that, that should do it. Wing Fortress is still kind of like stressful. You know, you never really know when you can fall and just die. I mean, not only, not only I, I was remembering the Mind Mortal reading, but I was also remember the Troll Pasta. Well, the whole creepy pasta thing was on the um, on the rise. Troll pastas were like, man, that shit we, we could never get out of shit. I remember we just go nights just scouting stories to read and just really cool. Such a fun thing to do back then. The thing is that just as creepy pasta culture kind of died, so did the troll pasta because the story were beginning to be just like. Too stupid. Too, uh, there were shit posts, in a sense. They were not trying to be funny. They were just throwing shit, and that's it. I think the last one we did was the liars or the Pokemon, the Pokemon mystery thing. But that was that was four years ago, I think. Creepy pastas haven't been popular since, really. I still sometimes listen to all, uh, some of the old movie videos, and I sometimes also reference him to him. Favorite one has to be uh, Pit the Cager. Hey, Kingpin, what's up? Yeah, making a, a sort of a comeback right now. Hopefully for good, we're gonna see. Long hoof. I also love finishing with Super Sonic because it's like saying, okay, Tails, you know what? I was fine, I didn't need you. I'm literally going supersonic right now. <laughs> but no, you know what? You're good, you're good. Ah, uh, next is Sonic 3. I'm doing all of them. Of, yeah. <laughs> Mega. 
There we go. Uh, Mania? No, I don't think I can do Mania, really. Oh, one second. There we go. Yeah, I, I, I noticed we're, I forgot to mute the mic. Normal game, no save. Let's go with... Let's go with Tails. Being a bro in this game. Yeah, hopefully I have enough time to finish this before the uh, Sonic Central stream starts. Should be good. Also, of course, I'm going to be getting the Emeralds. I cannot play this game without getting the Emeralds. That's just not happening. Let's go. Man, I remember when Air came out. That was like, the, this is legit the definitive way to play 3. So fucking much. I can die playing this game. <laughs> I'll be fine. This is the, this is my comfort zone. I wow wow. Okay, never mind. I messed up. It's been a while since I messed up like that. Holy shit! What happened right there? Okay, never mind. It can be fixed. But wow, I'm actually pretty surprised. What's going on, computer? Okay, never mind. You can just forget that little slip up. I just hope my controller doesn't just die mid game. Perfect. There we go. It's gotta be a perfect, of course. Yep. Easy. True ending? You mean the uh, the one with Supersonic? Or the normal one. I think the normal one would be better because it actually gives Tails a reason to go up there to get you. <laughs> because Tails gets up there and it's like, oh, okay, you don't really need my help because you're supersonic and you're flying. <laughs> what I do would love to see is that they actually added the in the um, in the iOS version, the phone version, they actually added that little cutscene. Connecting two to three. I love that. Did you see the dead egg uh, crashing into Angel Island? That is great. I love that little detail. Tying both games together. It also kind of makes me wonder about Angel Island because they have lush jungles and ruins and everything, but apparently they also have carnivals and they have mountains with snow. And they also have prisons in volcanoes. <laughs> Something is weird. Something happening in this place. The kidnaps were into some weird stuff. Unless the carnival was built by Eggman, I don't know, really. Oh, I still remember most of this. Most of it. I still remember all of them, let's be honest. I love this game so much, dude. It's actually ridiculous. Oh, one second. One time I should try, one, one day I actually should try to do a Sonic Adventure 1 sitting. I tried doing a Sonic Adventure 1 in one sitting, but the game bugged out. It's softlocked. A fucking place that should open, it didn't open, and I couldn't do anything. I love Adventure 1. Adventure 1 was like one of the games that I was dying to play back in the day. As a kid, I only wanted to... I, I only grew up playing 1, 2, and 3, and the moment I saw... In a video game show, I saw the intro to Sonic Adventure. I could not believe what I was seeing. <laughs> it was like seeing a fucking biblically accurate angel. My eyes were just bleeding because holy shit, I could not see anything so so beyond my comprehension. It's like Sonic in 3D. 
What a great game. Still holds up. Shine through air is good, yes. Ugh. I love when people just talk about, oh, Sony had a bad transition in 3D. And then they go on to mention one of the best games ever made in Sonic Adventure. You just you really can't complete. You really can't compete with uh, game journalists and any all of those critics from recent years. I don't know if it's people from inside the community think everything, but I remember back in the mid two thousands, there was like this wave of hate towards Adventure One and Two. It's like, oh shit, they're dated. They they look bad. They play shit. I'm like, what? No, they're not. <laughs> they're valid. What the hell? Now the tune is changing. Now they're just like being loved again. Which, yeah, the, I don't know why we decided to hate him in the first place, but okay. Back to the status quo and a high C. I'm really happy with the place Sonic is right now. We got a great movie. A great video game movie came out. Uh, Sonic, Central, uh, Sonic Central, I don't know if you know the channel, uh, Sonic Central. We're having a stream in a couple of hours um, discussing the Sonic movie. Everyone is welcome to jump. We're going to have Chow Mix, we're going to have Lee, of course. We're going to have um, a few other members of the community. So everyone is welcome to join for that. Oh, well, nice, aren't you? I'm going to be hearing my thoughts on Sonic Movie 2, if you've seen it, of course. It's going to be a, a spoiler review, so... If you've seen the movie, you can check it in the stream. If you haven't, but if you don't care about spoilers, then I guess you're good. Uh, what I was saying, that I think Sonic is in a really good spot right now. We got actor. Everyone seems to know what to do with Sonic except Sega and Sonic Team himself. We got fucking Paramount. It's great. The movie is amazing. The second one is great. Holy shit. We got the comics. IDW is killing it. I love the IDW comics. They're great. The fans are killing it. Projects like Sonic R and Sage just still going year after year after year. That's just beautiful. It's amazing. It's all up to Sega now to just put on the big boy pants and deliver a game that just shatters expectations for the good. I just want Sonic games to be good. Everything else Sonic is great except the game. Oh hell yeah, well then I'll see you on the stream, Ricardo. What's up? I'm just talking about the state of Sonic as a whole. I'm saying how he's in a pretty good place right now. Like everyone knows what to do with Sonic except Sonic Team. <laughs> Sonic is great. Everything Sonic is awesome except the game so far. The latest games, of course. They used to know what to do with him. So uh, <laughs> no. Uh, so I I'm good. I'm good. I need to go after finishing this one. <laughs> Although, I was thinking about doing a stream on Sonic Advance 1, 2, and 3. And just saying how uh, an Advance collection would be awesome. Sonic Advance 1, 2, 3, battle, and as a bonus, fucking um, Sonic Pinball Party. I think Pinball Party was it? I think it is. Basically all of the GBA Sonic games. The Advance games are great. Battle, I love battle. Drawing Sonic Battle style has actually been feeding me, so <laughs> I remember putting so many hours in Sonic Battle, trying to get the perfect Emerald. It's such a good game. And damn it, I want people of the community to start working on a Sonic Battle too. I will be so done. I will just like try to get my hands to to be the uh, to the artist for it too. <laughs> So 
Sonic Battle 2 is still a dream. Hopefully one day someone people from the community can do it. I would 100 percent do it, but I don't I don't know how where to start. I would I would just be a 2D artist. We need programmers, we need fucking everything. Coders, testers, I cannot do all that. I'm no good when it comes to that. But I 100% would love to do illustrations for Sonic Battle 2. Those are all the emeralds I can get in, a, in this act. I need to move to Hydro City. Uh, Hydro City to get more emeralds. I think this has to drop dash. No, it doesn't. battery this is something that i love that they fixed it it's actually a threat you have to jump stuff i remember playing the original game and the bombs would never hit you <laughs> no matter how fucking next to them they are <laughs> Thank you. I thought I'd soft lock for a second. I'm done with getting soft lock. Alright, I had the beta music for Knuckles for some reason. seen the movie yet I'm not gonna spoil absolutely anything I'm not gonna talk about the movie in this stream I wanna make sure that if you haven't seen the movie you should it's pretty good simple as that you're gonna enjoy it I'm glad that now finally we got good super uh, good video game movies and I'm so glad that if a video game movie had to be good I'm so glad it, it was Sonic You told me like five years ago that there's gonna be video game movies and they're gonna be good and it's gonna be Sonic in the forefront. I would have said, <laughs> yeah, sure. Integrated into my memory, I can really, I 
could have been pointed at before and after I actually knew how to do all of the special stages. Like, I don't remember the process of learning them. I just did them. I should have been. That would have been really heavy trying to figure out how to do this. And I did it as a kid. How the hell did I even do this? There we go. Simple. Nice. Sonic 4, but it's not gonna be Sonic 4, the one, um, it's not gonna be the Sonic 4 you expect. It's gonna be my favorite Super Nintendo version of Sonic 4, you know, the best one. One thing I never could remember how to get to that that part below where you can get that other special stage. I think I know, but I just I think you need a bubble. No, no, no. The thing is that I missed the special stage. That's good. There's plenty more. Oh wow, look at that. Game. Holy shit, let's go! stream we should actually go around looking for old Sonic animations. I would be sick actually because I remember there was an animation that I watched back in the day. I don't remember what it was called but I remember it was Sonic vs Shadow and it was of course bloody, it was Dragon Ball Z inspired. But it was pretty good. I remember seeing it like back in 2004 or 5. It was great. I never I've never saw it again after that one time, but it left an imprint because I remember going back to that animation, it was so good. <laughs> I just remember a lot of hits to the chin, and I think they were the ones super, but fuck, it's been so long, I really don't remember. This is my strategy, this is why I just leave one of the, of the ways open. As soon as I get the perfect, I can just run through and get the ones that I'm missing. Not a tutorial how to do it, this is just how I play it. 
you gotta do those <laughs> noises when you jump. Otherwise, you cannot make it. It's an old rule. Oh, that's it? Okay. Let's just grab all of them then. Look at the chat. I almost, that almost cost my life. That's another thing. I cannot complete the special status if I don't get the perfect. It's something that you have to do. You cannot complete the special status without the perfect. You might as well not have him completed him! We need the perfects. And there we go. At six, we're almost there. We just need the final one, which is gonna be... The end of the zone, yeah, I remember. So if we get that, then we're good for the Super Sonic, and then we just need to complete the first half of the game. And we should be good. Tails, come here. Damn it, I was about to ask him to help me. There we go. Tails, damn it. Okay, never mind. You know what? Oh, fuck. Well, Tails, you messed up. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. We're good. Can I get here? Yes, I can. I just can't believe this game is from 94. It's so well made. So ahead of its time. It's nothing really crazy, it's still just a side scroller, but what a great one. I played a lot of shit from back then that was like, ah, I cannot just cannot go back to it. I love the old games, well there's a lot of nostalgia for the Genesis. I grew up with the Genesis, so I played a lot of Genesis games. I played the Flintstones game, I played freaking Doraemon, I played Sunset Riders, I played freaking anything. Aladdin, Earthworm Jim, Quackshot. Quackshot was great, holy shit. Quackshot was one of my favorite Genesis games. And I remember that was one of the first instances of me trying to use English to complete the game. Because the game was in English, of course. I didn't speak English when I was a kid. So what I did is just to play the game with a dictionary right next to me. <laughs> and that's how I just figured out where to go, how how to do stuff. Fill in the blanks. It was a good it was a good experience. I didn't know how to speak it, so it actually helped a lot. That was actually one of the first memories I have of utilizing English. Should be on the opposite side, right? Right. Right. Wait a second. Maybe here. Yeah, there they are. Okay, good. Yeah, we did it. Supersonic boys. <clears throat> Supersonic time, easy. Save it for the boss. 
Where are my lasers go? <laughs> oh yeah. I edited the game so you can not hear the supersonic music at all. It's good, so we're gonna just enjoy the sick soundtrack. This was another instance when the game can sub lock when I played as a kid. If I went too fast to this boss, there was a chance that the boss would just not spawn. I remember that. Oh man. That was shit. I remember losing games like that a couple times. I love Marble Garden. A lot of people don't like it, but I just love Marble Garden. I don't like Marvel, but I like Marvel Garden. I think Marvel is way too slow and way too annoying. But Marble Garden, that's pretty good. Fast and nice little puzzles, good music. Oh yeah, now I can do that. Right. Oh, we're just gonna zoom through the game now. Super Sonic is so... It's such a fun reward to trying to get all those special stages. Oh, when we play Advance, I don't think I'm gonna be doing the Super Sonic run. I love doing Super Sonic in at least Advance 3 because the final battle is really epic. Teaming up with the Eggman, that shit is great, dude. But, uh, trying to find the Chow. It took me a long time to do that. So last, usually I would play the DS when I'm getting ready to bed. Like when I'm just in bed before going to sleep. And well sometimes I just not play it at all. But man, trying to get those chow is like ugh. I'm good. I'm fine. Best combination is Super Sonic and uh, the Electric Shield. Just grab the coins. The coin, the coin from Sonic. You got the rings to you. Look, the coin from Sonic. Also, if I remember correctly, they changed that. Yeah, thank God. I don't need that shit anymore. That shit was tedious. The original game, you have to break all of these floors. I'm glad they changed that at this one. I almost... My objective as a kid was always trying to kill this guy before even activating his, attack, his main attack. It's really hard to do, but I love it. Precise things that I need to do. I am really a perfectionist when it comes to the game. I gotta, I gotta try to kill that guy in one cycle. I gotta get all the perfects with the emeralds. That's just how I played the game back then. I don't know why. It was something about Sonic. Seeing Sonic stuff back then in a world that doesn't really have a lot of uh, official Sega stuff was really good. Now I see Sonic stuff all over here, mostly bootlegs. But still, it was so good to see Sonic Star back then. I need to figure out... Uh, since we didn't have an official Sega retailer, our copies of Sonic and Knuckles were literally just another cartridge. There was no way to connect three and Knuckles. But... Um, well, so the thing is that the cartridge for Sonic and Knuckles, it was not the normal Sonic and Knuckles, you know, the, the cool ass logo. No, it was some weird illustration of Sonic and Knuckles, like, in space or something. I need to find that illustration. I need to find out where that comes from. I would like I would like to see, like, a full picture of that. It's so weird. The bootleg illustrations for Sonic games are hilarious. Especially the new ones. Now we got cartridges like, I don't know, Sonic 1 or something. 
but the illustration is literally just a render for Sonic Generations or something like that. No care whatsoever. So we got still 10 people watching. Thank you for sticking by. Channel's been really, really dead, let's be honest, dead for a long time. <laughs> uh, it's really great to see that some people are still just coming in to check out. Even if it's a little bit, I really appreciate that. My girlfriend was actually just here asking how it was going. <laughs> and I appreciate every single one here watching. Even if you're just having the ass background noise, which is really good. Now the thing is that I didn't even we didn't even get originals here. Oh well again, no Sega retailers, so we didn't get official anything. It wasn't until like a couple of years ago when the PS3 was on that we got okay, we're getting actual Sony stuff here. I got a bunch of Sony games, my uh, PlayStation 3 games from back in the day. They're back in my collections. I do have well Latin America did have one official retailer for Sega, and that was Tech Toy. Tectoy was a Brazilian company that was one of the only ones who could actually have business with Sega in the 80s and 90s. <laughs> actually, that's one of the reasons why the Sega is way more popular in South America than uh, the NES. Brazil pushed the shit out of um, the Master System. The Master System was huge in Brazil, which is really weird for me, actually, <laughs> because here we have the bootleg version of the NES, which is called the Family Computer. The Famicom, we, we here we just call it the family. And I got an official tech toy version of Sonic 2 uh, case with the um, with the manual. It's back home, I need to get it. Right now the only cartridge I have is Sonic 3 and it's of course bootleg. A lot of bootlegs. My country is what you would call a pirate-friendly state, I think. <laughs> to be honest, I don't support it nor condone it. I mean, I, I grew up on it. Everyone grew up on it. I remember seeing cops asking people, Hey, can you chip my PS2 so I can play the good games? I don't think so. 32X was a little too much, but Brazil was an expert on trying to make Master System games again. In fact, they made a bunch of Master System ports that do not exist anywhere else but in Brazil. Check out Ultimate, uh, Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 for the Master System. That was a game that they developed, and it's a legit a port of UMK3 for the Master System. It's like, what? Uh, no, wait, I don't think it was UMK, I think it was just straight up Mortal Kombat 3. But uh, still, it's impressive that they actually did that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they made a bunch of other uh, bootleg games. But in good quality, at least. They tried. They're, they're the same guys behind the Sebo. <laughs> they, again, they tried, but well. It's kind of hard to thrive in this market. I don't know who was developing all the bootleg games for the Genesis back here, though. No idea. I just know about Tech Toy. That looks like. Oh. Yeah. Can I just go super? There we go. Alright. Easy boss, let's go. Wow, you actually missed one. 
Okay, never mind. Okay. Alright, two. Three. Wow. Sure, I'm taking this long. This is only both has like four hits. I'm cool with that. I don't mind. No reason for these spots to be annoying. So yeah, I'm, I'm rocking the uh, the Vader version of the song. I prefer this one to the original. <laughs> that is the only song I prefer from the Vader. Uh, I prefer the original, the the final release, um, Ice Cap, and I prefer also the final cut of uh, Base Launch Base. It's called Base. <laughs> Genesis stream one day. Explain Genesis shit that I used to play as a kid. It was this one Genesis game called MIG29. It was a, an obscure joke in one of my videos that I'm pretty sure no one, no one got. Um, it was a, a flight simulator for the Genesis called MIG29, I think, or something like that. Uh, and for some reason, I was terrified of that game back then as a kid. It had... Uh, when you die, they place you a little small animation, like movie, of a real uh, make crashing. And I was like, what the f Why are you showing me planes crashing? That shit is terrible. And a horrible last music, too. Also, I'm dying. I'm gonna die. I need a balloon. Thank you. Uh... I prefer having some aspects of the original and some aspects of the beta. For example, this song I like better than the original. But for Ice Cap, I prefer Ice Cap original, and for Launch Base, I prefer it too. For Knuckles Team, I prefer the original, but I forgot to change it, so I still have the beta on. <laughs> I'm really glad that they actually give you the option to at least choose. fan of the stage as a kid. I kind of like still not the biggest fan of the stage, but it's, it's okay, I guess. I just want to get over it so, we, so I can go run into uh, Ice Cap because Ice Cap is fucking great. Also, Eggman build this carnival night thing? I refuse to believe the Echidna, the Echidna tribe actually have a city filled like full-on carnival place to <laughs> just go... <laughs> Uh, we're still in Angel Island, right? Why is this a part of Angel, Angel Island? There we go, we're, we're, we're at the end now. Yeah, just go. everything. <laughs> okay, never mind. I guess I didn't change the fucking song. What a dumbass. God damn. I cannot switch it now. Oh, there we go. 
I guess I just fucked up and I just put all of the Veda songs. Oh man. This does not feel good. <laughs> it has to be hard times. It's not hard times. Sonic Origins though also is that ever gonna happen I feel like I, I I heard that they actually deleting some tweets regarding origins something something ain't right with origin I'm you know what I don't want it to be shit with the uh, Sonic 3's licensing with the music and stuff because that would that would blow Actually saying that, oh man, it's been a while since we've seen Sonic 3. <laughs> and you're telling me we might not even see it again. <laughs> and it felt like a great move back in the day, but I guess not anymore. Maybe that's why they can't release uh, San Andreas stories, uh, Vice City stories again, because of Phil Collins, but. <laughs> understand what the position it was Michael Jackson in the 90s he was still like the biggest star in the world <laughs> so I didn't know it was gonna be a bunch of legal trouble or you know, whatever it's not only my Michael remember it's something to do with Brad Boxer and stuff like that you know, people like that Imagine if it comes out, dude. I, I cannot imagine how the, it's gonna be like the holy grail of the community. Finding the Tokyo Game Show one, Tokyo Show, Tokyo Toy Show, whatever. That will be massive on the community. It will be a big piece of history. I hope one day we get it. I remember when they found the prototype. Made a video about it. That was great. <clears throat> Wish I had seen it live, but I was not too into the community by, by then. Someone said they're gonna go to sleep with the sound of the ring counter. I'm sorry. Oh, let's finish this one. When you're in the end, though, we only have this launch base, and then we have the knuckles, some the knuckles part of it. Go. 
Oh man, I also have launch base in beta. I really screwed up, man. Damn it. What about to just get 50 but now I don't know. Good thing that unlike the start of this game when I need to go through um, Angel Island and then Hydro City, I can get all of the emeralds in uh, Mushroom Hill. I should get the super emeralds. It'll be fairly easy. I can again, once again, show you my stupid way of getting the last one in a needlessly hard way because I never figure out how to do it how you're supposed to. And I refuse to see any way to how to do it. Hey Sammy, what's up? Canada, man. I want to move to Canada, actually, eventually. Oh, one second. Canada. We're probably looking to move up near, well, not near outside of the city, not in the proximity, but hopefully soon enough in the next three years. That's our aim. The next three years, we want to be out of here. Oh, dude, that's the thing. I love the cold. I absolutely love the cold. I come from the southernmost city in the world, and we get cold all the time. I love the cold, so I'm used to it. <laughs> yeah, that is great. Hopefully, I'll get to move there soon. I need to finish college first. There's two years left, and then I'm out. Let's avoid that part. I feel like I'm going too fast on this. Oh, yeah, I definitely am. I forgot that you can just basically skip that entire part, let's just be transparent for the battle. I need to change everything back. I don't like the Veda music on all the stages. I like the Veda music, but not in all the stages. favorite Sonic game is uh, this one, you're looking at it, Sonic 3, and Knuckles is my favorite Sonic game of all time, no questions asked. I grew up with this game, I play this game at least five times a year I play this game. I play this game since I was five, I'll be 30 in a month, so <laughs> Sonic 3 has been a part of my life for most of it. Sonic for a long time. I kind of like got away from the community back in like 2008, but uh, now I'm back. Now I actually work as a freelance art artist doing Sonic illustrations most of the time, <laughs> and I like helping out community projects and community events. And hopefully going back to making videos. 
Oh wait, I can go super. Semi. Thanks a lot for stopping by. We're nearing the end of the stream now. I'm gonna finish this game and uh, it's gonna be. If you wanna see a little bit more, um, head over to Sonic Central channel. We're gonna have a discussion about the Sonic movie too. Uh, of course, if you've seen it, because it's gonna be a uh, spoiler um, stream. Yeah, it's fine. I like the fact that Sonic is now spreading far beyond the games now. It's not that you don't need to play it. Now you can just read it or watch it. I like that. You can read the IDW comics to, be, to get some of the best stories. You can watch the movies to get some of the best characterization. The games are still fun, but it's fine to... Uh, you got other options now. It's not like back then where you could only get the games. Oh, it's fine. You can catch a stream after um, after we're done with it and you watch the movie. How are we you? I heard they're great for hacking. Oh, it's very fast forward. That's it. All right. Yeah, look at that. That fire effect. Everything was great when you stick it off. Cheese these balls real quick. Hoppy oh, arms. I always thought that when I played Sonic 3 and I was like, okay, something's missing because back in the day. I didn't know that Sonic 3 and Knuckles was a thing. I was just like, okay, it's Sonic 3, and then it's Sonic and Knuckles. Uh, I'm playing on PC. This is uh, Sonic 3 Air. It's a fan mod of Sonic 3, make, making it more modern friendly. Um, so. I didn't know that I, I didn't know that it was like a big one big adventure. I thought it was okay, it's Sonic 3, big arms and okay, uh, it's just big arms. It's like eh, whatever. I feel like, well the game is short. Sonic 2 was way longer. And then the final boss is just like this underwhelming mech. I didn't realize that Sonic Green Uncles was a thing. Okay, we're good, we're falling. Exactly, exactly. It just feels like that. It's just like Mania. Okay, so we're on the final stretch now. We're starting the, the Knuckles section. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm not. I'm, no holds barred. I'm going straight up to the biggest, hardest uh, special stage. the emeralds real quick. I really wish one day we get to see the super emeralds again. It's this one. Alright, here we go. Pay attention everyone, this is how you do a really hard stage in a really hard way without reason really. I'm just dumb. Let's go. Part one, here we go. One. Shit. Uh, uh, good. I don't know how to complete this the way you're supposed to. This is just my way that I discovered when I was a kid and I've never forgotten. Because it's such a monumental task. 
There we go. there I just need to not mess up okay hard part right now Ugh, there we go Ugh. yes did it oh man that's my way of being the stage. Oh, I saw that transition uh, sprite. I don't know why it's not here. Especially since this uh, mod adds a lot of stuff from the Veda. Though my version of Air, it's um, it's outdated. I need to update it actually. Start the session. Yeah, apparently it's not that hard, but I never figured out how to do it the way you're supposed to. That's just the way that I figure out how to do it as a kid. Still no idea how you do it. That launched me right there. Huh, so it's not there. Yeah, they shoot at it. Why not? Oh, I messed up. I don't know why Tails not flying me anymore. Tails, what, what's up? What gives? Yeah, people mod the crap out of this game all the time. I like it. On Sammy, thanks a lot for stopping by. You're welcome whenever. Take care. Oh man, this one is also pretty bad. This is the second one. It's it looks easy because it's literally just go around in a square. But um, I think it's that one misstep and you you screwed. <laughs> One thing I never considered doing is actually speedrunning to some degree. I don't know if I should. I don't know where to start to learn. That's the thing. I wouldn't know where to start. Oh, thank you, Sammy. Hopefully, I can get a video out soon. Like, I remember failing the special stage a lot, even though it looked so easy. I hope my controller doesn't die in the middle of this. There we go. Easy. Okay, I got the two hardest one out of the way. We are good. Whew. I gotta beat this game in an hour. That's when the stream starts. Hopefully I get to do this in a, on a Sonic Central stream one day. Just going around destroying Sonic 3. That's my mission in life, just destroying Sonic 3.
Funny thing is that my favorite game of all time is Sonic 3 and Knuckles. I, I just call it Sonic 3 because, well, it it's just one adventure. It's just Sonic 3. I just call it Sonic 3. I don't like calling it Sonic 3 and Knuckles. It's just Sonic 3. My second favorite game of all time has got to be Bloodborne. Straight up. It's such a great experience. The design of everything, the aspect, the, the lore. Inspired on Dracula and Lovecraftian stuff. Everything is just there. Clicks. It's so good. Oh, I'm, I just very weird. Okay. Wow. I didn't realize I got all the others. Okay. Pretty good. Kind of blacked out there. I forgot that I grabbed all of them. So weird, man. This is such, uh, such a second nature. I can picture myself not knowing this. Like, I don't remember the process of me learning all of this. <laughs> now it's automatic. It's like breathing. You, you don't, you don't learn breathing. You just do it. Might be a stupid comparison, but I, <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I have, but I don't really use it. Uh, if you want to keep in touch, you can do it through Twitter. You can follow me at, uh, at DNLVita. Sorry, I don't usually uh, use my Discord. <laughs> Very simple. And that's it. That's all you can get in Act 1. Now let's just finish this. We should be good for the rest. We only have half of them, more than half of them, so we should be good. And once Hypersonic is unlocked, uh, it's basically game over for the game. Good job, Tails. Can you fly me though? What happened? Why can't you fly me anymore? Remind me that I need to change all the settings for the music. <coughs> oh, sorry. That was another thing that I noticed when I said when I was a kid playing this game. Something that was weird when it came to um, Sonic 3 and Knuckles, because remember, uh, we only have Sonic and Knuckles, we didn't have the combination of the games. Noticing the water bubbles, it's like why are there water bubbles in this game, there's no water Sonic and Knuckles. And it's true, in the second half of the game, there's no water at all. Let's go this one. Oh, this one is pretty annoying. This game has 
grass, no water. Ah, uh, game. Okay, you know what? Screw it. Screw the rules. Oh. My allergies are kicking out. What am I doing? Okay, never mind. I guess I just grab these. Before getting all the other ones, aha, more. Should be the last one? No, I still have one more. By the end, you get 144 rings in this stage. Need to find the last one. Uh, no. Oh, here we are. There we go. Alright, now I'm gonna start grabbing all the other last figures. Take those. Two sets of four more. The game is going too fast. Chill out. There's two more. And the last four. I don't know where the hell could they be. Oh. Yes. Okay, that's one. Uh, I think we had two more and that's it. Game is gonna give up real quick. Uh, where is all Simple. Oh man, hopefully I can finish this. I got. Le I just realized that I have less than an hour to finish this. <laughs> It's gonna be way faster once I have a hypersonic.
And the last one is at the transition between stages. These are relatively easy sort of special stages, except for the last, the first one, or the last two that I did first. Not a fan. Oh, I'm gonna show you the uh, thing that I've done. Oh, thank you, Wizard Blizzard. Thank you for stopping by. We're just chilling a little bit. The little people we have left. Uh, luckily, we're gonna get more content soon. I'm actually, this is my comeback stream. Uh, I don't know if I can promise consistency, but I can promise that at least I'm gonna have something prepared. Uh, almost at the uh, tail end of our Sonic Classic Trilogy uh, Marathon. And in about an hour, I'm gonna be heading to Sonic Central's channel for uh, a Sonic 2 discussion. If you've seen the movie, you wanna join? It'll be great. It's gonna be a spoiler review. Oh, that's it. I didn't realize it was all. <laughs> forgot. I actually just forgot. Damn. One million points. Look at that. The most important aspect of any game. Fucking points. Alright, okay, we did it. First, I need uh, to get that extra uh, bonus stage that I told you. I'm gonna need a fire bottle, a fire shield here. And I need to go right there. Yeah, actually, here. Stand here and you start doing this. Start doing this. Keep doing it until you eventually just pass. Don't worry, you're not just... There we go, look at that. And right into another special stage. That shit is great. Don't ask me how I figured that out. I really legit don't remember. I don't know what I was like, doing, just go banging my head against the wall. Okay, let's get this over with. What the hell was that, Tails? Let's go. Did the game just glitch? I'm pretty sure it started the Robotnik theme as soon as I transformed. Okay, there we go. Sonic. Things are gonna be pretty easy now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go. Always love playing better. Such a cool song, really such a cool thing. <laughs> cool thing. Everything is great about this. Except maybe the boss, but whatever. Okay, don't mess up. I am pretty. I tend to go too fucking fast. Too fucking fast. In this section, for sure, we need to be a little bit slower. <laughs> no, 
no! Ah. You know what? Screw it. I'm hyper. I don't care. I let you can do whatever. If Super was busted, then man, Hyper is just mega busted. Literally just swimming through. <laughs> We literally just do nothing. My favorite. There we go. That wasn't hard. <laughs> Look at all those lives. This song in particular reminds me when I was a kid I used to give lyrics to the song so the game. <laughs> I don't remember anything, but I remember that this one was being like the, the biggest one. Oh boy. go slope after slope of getting grabbed by one of those balls. I thought it was Mania, but apparently it's also here. So I just gotta wait. Come on. I would love to see a reference like this in a movie. It's like movie could... These enemies. Why are they so like, constant in this game? <laughs> Fly anymore. There we go. Come on, 
buddy. There we go, good shit. Alright, again, just gotta wait because I'm just so fast. Bad news, I need to leave right now actually. <laughs> I forgot I got something to do and then we're gonna get the stream. Oh man, I hate leaving at this note, but <laughs> we were so close. Oh damn. Okay, don't worry. Uh some other time I actually finished this game. I already beat this game on stream like four times in this channel. <laughs> but ah, uh, I'm very sorry I'm leaving at this note. I really need to leave right now, actually. But uh, everyone, thank you so much for joining. It was a blast. Uh, I'm coming back now. I'm going to be working on more videos, and hopefully I'll get something for you soon. So till the next time, stay safe.